Hello, I'm Maria, a product development scientist at SPT LabTech, and I'm here with my favorite instrument, Firefly. I'm getting ready to run a pooling protocol, and I'll walk you through how exactly I'm going to do that. So first of all, uh, the software is open at the moment, um, it's ready to go. I will just need to load the protocol that I've previously written. And to do that, I can just open the protocol and select the one that I want. Here it is. And after it opens, um, it will load here. So at the current screen, uh, you can see all the steps that are contained in the protocol, as well as all the assets. Um, but what I'm interested in for execution is the summary. So I would like to see what steps are in my protocol, and you can see it right here. Um, and next, in order to prepare for my setup, uh, it is useful to know what exactly, what parts you require, what labware, what tips and plates. And here on the screen, you can see that there will, I'll need three plates uh, and I'll need two tip boxes with tips. So now I can start doing the setup and loading. Um, and here is the overview of what my uh, instrument deck would look like after I finish setup. Uh, and now I'll just go step by step, uh, moving all the things in the right places. So first of all, I would uh, load the tips. And to do that, I can press get access. Uh, and the instrument will present itself in the most efficient way for me to start loading. So the first uh, item that goes into the deck is the set of 96 tips. It's an array of tips and it goes into the position L2 on the lower deck. Uh, next, uh, I'm loading another set of tips. This time it is a strip tip and it's going into position L3. And I will proceed to load the plates. The plates are going onto the upper deck. And I will start with the empty plate in position U2. And then I will move into the next uh, empty plate into position U3. And uh, the last one to load is the plate with my sample. Um, it is a different 96 volt plate uh, in position U7. Uh, and now the setup is complete. So now my instrument is in the right position and has everything that's required to start running the protocol. I'm now going to initiate the pooling protocol by pressing play in the execute screen. And the first operation here is the pipetting head picking up a 96 uh, array of tips. With these tips, the pipetting head will uh, transfer some of the liquid from our source plate into an intermediate plate where we would perform the pooling. Now you can see the tips are being picked up by the pipetting head. And then the tips would move into the source plate, uh, aspirating an air gap and moving into the liquid to aspirate some of the liquid. Now you can see the liquid going up. And now the liquid is transferred into the intermediate plate. We're doing that in order to prevent contaminating the sample in the source plate. So we're creating an intermediate plate from which we will perform the pooling. Now you can see the liquid got dispensed and we're performing a left-right tip touch and the front-back tip touch. Um, to ensure that all the liquid got moved and there's no liquid remaining in the tips. Now we're going to um, unload the array of 96 tips. And next the pipetting head will move on to pick up uh, another set of tips. This time it will be a strip tip. Uh, it is a strip of eight tips. And the pulling will be performed by moving uh, into the columns of our intermediate plate. This way, uh, all of the samples will be pulled using the eight strip. Now you can see the strip is being picked up and on the right, you can see the strip of eight tips. Next, the strip is moving into our intermediate plate and starting from column 12, it's going to aspirate the liquid from column 12, and then move into column 11. Again, aspirate liquid from there, move into column 10, 
and so on. It will move across the whole plate in order to pull all the samples. You can see the liquid is raising up in the tips as the samples are being pulled from the consecutive columns of the 96 volt plate. Pulling will be performed into one column and it will end up in the um, final plate. And from this plate, if desired, the samples can be pulled into one um, well or into one tube by using a manual pipette. So now you can see the, the liquid is going into the final destination plate. Um, and this column uh, one on the final plate will contain the pool of all the samples from the intermediate plate. Now all this liquid is dispensed into column one. It's been dispensed quite slowly to ensure that the liquid um, fully empties the tips. Uh, and there was a left-right tip touch. And now the final step of the protocol is unloading the cassette containing a strip of eight tips. Now the tips are unloaded and this is the end of our protocol. Uh, at the end of the protocol, uh, the instrument will home, you'll see the pipetting head is going to the back and this is the end. <laughs>